Bobby, take care of the ball. Don't make silly passes. One, two, three. Hey, go. The Boilermakers of Purdue have attained national prominence with their special brand of basketball excitement. Furious, fast paced and fun, Purdue's style of play has kept Boiler fans on the edge of their seats with dramatic wins and fabulous individual performances. For the fans, the players and the coaches, Boilermaker basketball is something special. Purdue basketball is Terrific. <laughs> Purdue basketball to me is a lot of hard work and a lot of fun. Purdue basketball is class. Purdue basketball is the most exciting program in the nation with an unmatched winning tradition and a future that looks even brighter. To wear the gold and black is to know the meaning of pride and dedication. You have an opportunity to become a part of a successful team with one goal in mind, to become the best team in America. The man behind Purdue's winning tradition is head coach Gene Cady. For Coach Cady, the welfare of his players is first and foremost. Probably uh, the, the thing that may be the dearest uh, to me and our staff is our players because that's what we're here for, to try to make sure they get an education and to make sure they play up to their potential. And if I can motivate them to do that, then we've got a chance to be successful and enjoy each other. And, and uh, our main goal, of course, is to win the Big Ten and win the national title and uh, be the best possible team in the, in the nation. On November 20th, 1982, the Boilermakers took a major step forward in their journey to the top of the basketball world. For on that day, they would represent the United States by playing the national team of the Soviet Union. The rugged Russians had demolished the previous opponents in their American tour, and the Purdue players and coaches knew that they would have to play flawlessly to defeat the Soviet Olympic team. As expected, the game became a classic matchup of quickness and strength. Playing for school pride and national pride, the Purdue team was determined not to get out muscled under the boards. All Big Ten center Russell Cross, who has since joined the pro ranks, played an inspired game, scoring 15 points and collecting 12 rebounds. Led by number 21, point guard Ricky Hall, the Boilers played an opportunistic game, forcing turnovers and charging down court before the Russians had a chance to set up their defense. Two minutes and 19 seconds left on the clock, Purdue was ahead by six, but Coach Cady knew that the Russian team would be at its best when under pressure. Sure enough, the Soviets pulled within one point until Steve Reed hit a corner jump shot with less than a minute left. But the Russians surged ahead again, and Purdue would have only one chance left to win or lose. Clausen's last second clutch jump shot stunned the Russians and ignited a celebration in West Lafayette that will be remembered for years to come. For Coach Cady, it was vivid proof that his young squad could successfully compete against the best teams in the nation and the world. For the Purdue coaching staff, the most important thing is for the players to be successes on the court and in life. 
A college degree is every student athlete's first priority, and there is no better place to get an education than at Purdue University. Located on 650 acres in beautiful West Lafayette, Indiana, Purdue offers excellent undergraduate and graduate programs in everything from agriculture to computer science, communications to humanities. The 32,000 students who attend the university come from every part of the world. Even though the university is large, with an operating budget well over a third of a billion dollars, the campus is filled with the warmth and friendliness of a small Midwestern town. Whatever your lifestyle, Purdue offers the opportunity to meet new friends and enjoy college life. Purdue and the Union have a lot of things for students to get you acquainted, especially if you're a freshman, with people on campus. And I'm, in, I'm Greek, like in sorority, and there's a lot of parties that we have, and all campus parties, and parties between fraternities, and that's it's really fun. You can dance and get to know a lot of people. Approximately 12,000 students live in the residence halls, and thousands more live in the more than 50 fraternity and sorority houses. The basketball players live their freshman years in the residence halls, along with the other students. And the accommodations are comfortable. A friendly game of foosball is never far away. Eating well is important to both body and mind. A special training table that provides plenty of home quality food and refreshment is just a small part of Purdue's commitment to its student-athletes, according to athletic director George King. Well, I think, I think the important thing uh, that, that one must uh, think about as he, as he or she selects a school is really what kind of care will the university, will the department personnel uh, have for my son or daughter. In our basketball Check program, for instance, we spend close to $20,000 a year in our tutoring service. We have great counseling staff for our academics and for our liaison with the university as a whole and all of the curriculum and all the departments. We really care about our students and we're very proud of the fact that uh, so many of our students uh, graduate on time. I think our percentage in the last 20 years is like 92 or 94 percent of all of our student athletes in basketball have graduated on time and we're very proud of that record. Caring for the athletes as complete human beings means providing the finest support facilities in the nation. Preventing injury is a major objective at Purdue. The players are given top-notch medical care and special medical attention is always available through the school's full-time doctors. Reaching for the ball. Mm -hmm. You having pain? Yes. Yeah. My shoulder up here. Yeah, word box, can you put one finger about where the For guard is? Herb Robinson, okay. Purdue's combination of skilled about medical right personnel and caring administration okay. is a successful combination. They take really good care of the athletes. They have the right conditions and the right people to take care of and they really do a good job. One of Coach Katie's fundamental keys to success is a solid conditioning program. In the well-equipped gym, the players regularly work out on a mix of resistance equipment, universal, nautilus, and free weights. Each athlete's program is individually designed and monitored, and leg and upper body strength are greatly improved. Endurance, agility, and quickness are also worked on. The goal is for every athlete to play basketball at its highest potential. Some Purdue athletes have played so well that their basketball careers have taken them into the professional ranks. Keith Edmondson of the Atlanta Hawks and Joe Barry Carroll of the Golden State Warriors are only two names from the long list of pro players that includes Rick Mount, Terry Dishinger, Walter Jordan, and Jerry Sichting. Joe Barry Carroll, the number one NBA draft pick in 1980, was not only a consensus All-American at Purdue, but he was also an academic All-American. Being a success in basketball and in life is the primary teaching of head coach Gene Cady. Screen, block off top and concentrate on what we're trying to do. Now tonight, uh, Ricky, you're going to start on Harper and you know he's dangerous. So in our man-to-man -man defense, 
First of all, Kurt and Ricky or Steve or whoever's in there, Mac, you got to contain your guards. Don't let them penetrate. We're here to support you and try to guide you if you need help. We try to have meetings once every two weeks with our players individually so we can see what they need to work on, watch film, uh, talk about their social life, or if they need help personally, we're here to do that. My door is always open for my players to come in and visit with me. Routine, rhythm, concentration, and confidence. Coach Katie believes that if the players can master the fundamentals of the game, they will be successful. Go behind the screen, Russell's screening him. Purdue's now style of play is built upon game. Coach Katie's fundamentals man. for winning. Now we're in our high-low. Aggressiveness, smart basketball where you get the most out of your talent, where we're playing great man-to-man -man defense, smart shot selection on offense with a fast break that will get the easy basket for you and where you're developing your skills to the utmost because you work hard in practice. After all the hard work, all of the coaching and all of the sweat. It's time to do what you came to Purdue for in the first place. Have fun playing basketball. My freshman year when I came here, I was really astounded by all the support that the players get because back home in St. Louis, basketball really isn't that big you know and I wasn't used to the big crowds and everything but the first game I came here it was really amazing because the fans are up most of the game cheering and and shouting and everything and it, it's really great Coach Katie here at Purdue makes it fun for the players and tries to take a lot of the pressure off us by uh, making it more of a game instead of a job that we're here to do. It's a lot of fun to go out there in front of 14,000 people and just start doing the thing you like to do. Okay, one, two, three. With another sellout crowd filling Mackey Arena, it's time for the excitement to begin. With one of the most challenging schedules in the nation, the Boilers battle such top-notch opponents as Indiana, Georgia, DePaul, Ohio State, Syracuse, Louisville, and Houston. It's a schedule that demands the most of the players and coaches. You get after 20 with a 41. Just you. Boilermaker! If he makes them back in 20... is a member of the prestigious Big Ten Conference and has a long tradition of conference successes. In fact, no other school has won the Big Ten Championship more times than Purdue. And the Boilermakers' winning percentage ranks second in the league. For players like Steve Reed, Purdue's success on the court comes from its emphasis on academics. Definitely use your head and your mind, and then that carries over when you get onto the basketball floor, you know, helps you out. When you're playing in a game, you know, if you can think in the classroom, then you'll be able to think on the court. The transition from high school athletics to college athletics involves a step up in intensity and discipline because every game is important when you're striving to become the national champions. In high school, you know, it's hard to, sometimes, some games it's hard to get up because of the competition you're playing, but in college, you're always playing somebody that's better than you or tougher than you, and you have to be mentally ready to play. You get a lot of exposure to different media coverage, and it's a, it's a good place to play. You know, you play against your Bobby Knights and your Illinois and your Ohio States, and it's, it's fun. We're proud of you, proud of you, because we could handle the ball better, but you did a good job we had to be. As the Boilermakers carry on their winning tradition, their fan support grows every year. One, two, three. Yeah. There's a lot of support from our fans, and I think more and more that they're... Uh, realizing our unity that we have as a team and that our togetherness and uh, they see us as a unit and uh, on campus I think we're looked up to quite a bit because of that. Athletics here is so 
it's such big time that I think people do put them up high even though they are very friendly and you can talk to them. From a conversation with a newfound friend on the West Lafayette campus to the thrill of a last second conference victory, Purdue University offers all the advantages and excitement of big time college basketball. From the beginning of the season, the goal is to win the Big Ten Conference Championship and then to go on to postseason play. From 1979 to 1982, the Boilermakers saw postseason action in the Final Four of the NCAA or NIT for four consecutive years. After becoming the first Big Ten school to win the NIT in 1974, the Boilers have been in postseason play almost every year. Purdue's overall tournament record is 25 wins, 8 losses. And the future looks very bright for more big wins. I think we can win the national championship because we have all the tools to do that. We have tradition and uh, the, the arena and the fans are here to support us and uh, the administration certainly is behind us 100% and we have a super athletic program here. We have a super league and the TV coverage is super and uh, that always makes young men look our way and we know we're going to be on TV a lot so we're going to get great exposure and we know that that's important to them. If playing in front of more than 14,000 screaming fans and a national television audience sounds like fun to you, if attending an outstanding university that offers one of the nation's finest programs in business, computer science, pre-law and medicine sounds interesting to you, then Purdue University is the place for you. If you are challenged by the prospect of striving to be a member of one of America's top teams, then you are ready to put on the golden black of the Purdue Boilermakers for exciting winning basketball and the pride of obtaining a college education. Purdue University is a special place where dreams can become reality.